I started off a little rough, like my first uh, nine holes, and then I had a really nice comeback. I was very happy the way I finished my last 27 holes yesterday. I was four under through those 27 holes. Um, I was very happy with how I was hitting my iron shots overall, and even today I had one bad hole towards the end, but other than that, I think I was playing very solid throughout um, the whole three rounds. I had some good drives, good iron shots, and I think my putting was on, so I think it's good for future tournaments to come for how I played. The second round, when I turned it around, that was my career love for college, which was very exciting for me. That's my first under par round I've had yet. I've had some close to par and at par, but it was, it's always been a goal to me for me to be able to shoot under par at a college tournament, so I'm very excited that I was able to do that. Kayla's 75 today, a really good finish for her. She's, uh, she's coming off her wrist surgery and hasn't competed since last October, with the exception of the tournament earlier this fall so um, she's just been full force no excuses um, just working so hard this fall so it's nice to see uh, her put together a solid round like she did today and then yeah the Allison's level of play for those 27 holes is, is we're just phenomenal and it's, it's so fun to coach that it, it was so fun to be with her knowing the significance of that round that it was going to be a, a, a career best for her and uh, just seeing that the pride and the joy in, in her eyes was um, you know a really special moment for, for me as a coach just the joy and the thrill of, of playing at home, playing your home course. Um, the weather certainly helped. It was absolutely perfect. So the excitement of having our fans here and, and all the volunteers and the, the shuttlers and the live scorers who are, who are friends and, and fans and uh, cheering us on the whole way just to, just makes a really special two days for us. And you have so many people that are nice enough to come out and watch. We had a lot of people in the athletic department and then friends and family that were out here cheering us on today. So that always makes it a lot more exciting to have fans there watching you.